Oh, good morning, Monday. I know, I'm a good singer. Hey, you guys, today's footage is gonna be the rest of the footage of the weekend of Cooper's baseball game. And, um, yeah, but I wanted to preface it because, you guys, tonight at 8.30 post standard time, PST or Mountain Standard Time, I can't remember, um, Kaylee and I got to go and do this really incredible, amazing, um, kind of like a give back service type of thing. And it's actually the most excited I've ever been about a project that I've ever been able to work with and do. It's something that just makes you feel good inside and it just makes you realize how blessed you are and how much we have to give and how many people in the world are suffering and going through much, much harder things than we are. And so we were asked by BYU TV to come and film a segment for this beautiful family who is really going through a hard time. And I am so so excited about this episode and about this um, concept that BYU TV is doing. It's called hashtag random acts TV. And basically they're um, taking nominations for families or people who deserve a random act of kindness and something just to kind of make their life better. So I'm gonna leave all the information down in the description box below. There's actually a web link where you can watch it right from the web. Um, and then it gives, um, I'll give you guys like the DISH channel network it will be on as well as um, channels around the Idaho and Utah area. Um, a lot of people probably don't live in Idaho and Utah who watch our videos, so I'll leave all the information below at the top of the fold in the description box. Make sure you guys check that out and just leave a lot of love for this family. I'm so excited. It's Gage's birthday. We're going to go up and have some birthday cake and fun with Gage tonight. And yeah, so watch the episode. Open your heart up because it's something that's really... Um, it's changed my life and my whole opinion and viewpoint of how we can really impact and influence others. Happy Monday. Check out the episode. You guys won't regret it. Um, Kaylee and I are like over the moon excited for it. Amigo is not feeling very good. Him's kind of sick. But I was going to take him on a run. Look, I got my running shoes on. We have the Tough Mudder this weekend and I have got to run it out. I have cleaned the house and done all the dishes, put them away. We've had a little planning session for Monday. The laundry has started. I'm taking out the garbage. Look, loads are going. Monday is like my day to get everything in order and then Tuesdays I try to film and then for the rest of the week have content. So I'm feeling ahead of the day even though it's 12 o'clock. I slept in a little bit because I needed the sleep. I was like so behind. Can you tell how fast I'm talking? Wow. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna take Amigo on a run, run some errands, and yeah, happy day. Full countdown. Oh, nice. Run, run, run. Slow, no. Oh, woo! Good job, buddy. Way to get on base. Hey, Coop. Junior food. Look at we got the whole crew. Oh, Annie, you're going to get some snacks, Rach, Mom Sid, Mac, Mom, Lisa, Holly, kids. You guys, this is my cousin, my first best friend cousin ever. Oh, Sisters for life. Sisters for life. Look at her cutest little girl. Can I just have her? You catch I'm trying to have one, but it's just, you know, look at her cutest feet. <laughs> Sometimes I already have my bag filled up with Target clothes. No child. Just, just send them to me. Yeah. <laughs> Check out. Send it to Holly. Hi. Use a crazy puppy, Migo. All right. Coop's out on second. Oh, he's scary. All right, we got Dale. You guys, this vlog footage is gonna be real windy, but we just had to get Coop's, Coop's baseball. So we're running to the store right now because we're in charge of the little barbecue between games and we're winning. So we're going on to the third game, which is the championship game. And it's- There's a dead cat on the way. Oh, kitty. It's at eight o'clock tonight. So thankfully we have my grandma's house. Sorry, just squirrel, but can you just look at that green field of mountain? Is that the prettiest thing you've ever seen? Sometimes when we drive through the country- oh my gosh. I feel like we're driving through the um, Windows XP Microsoft background. <laughs> and when you go to high school and you log in, and it'll be the background on the computer. That's so where we live is the background of Microsoft. But um, good thing, yeah, we have my grandma out here because we can just go take a nap at her house. Amigo did not sleep last night at all. It was so hot in her room, so he was panting and like on on the bed, off the bed, and then he was scratching at the door, and I was just like, oh, you're gonna wake up my grandma. And then the fan above our bed, like something was wrong with it, so it was like grinding really loud. I felt like I was in Fallujah in a freaking air raid. <sighs> but then I, then I fixed it because 
I don't know what was going on, but not like I fixed it. I just turned the knob and got lucky and it stopped making the sound. And it clicked all the way on and then it was cooled down. And then I was sleeping better, but Amigo was still just like, they have a cat at my grandma's house. And so he- it gave me anxiety. I think he was just like wanting to play with the cat. And you know when you're in a new place. But anyways, hopefully we'll go to all take a nap. But it's fun to stay with my grandma. I have so many memories at my grandma's house that I was telling Jackson. Like for breakfast this morning, she had the same orange juice container that I had when I was a little girl and we drank out of it. And it was just the cutest thing ever. Just I admire my grandma. people that, like that, just very reliable, very. Yeah, she's very valid. hospitable. Yeah, you can tell they got a strong foundation. Yeah, my grandma, she's one, hers is one of a kind. So we're gonna go pick up some fried chicken and some potato wedges and we can have a barbecue. Them, these boys, huh, Dale? It's my favorite thing in the world. So Fried chicken. I got my wife, <laughs> got my family, got coop, we got fried chicken. It's good. good. Yeah, how great is our family? Jackson's family drove all the way from Salt Lake to watch my aunt Mama and my Sid, cousin came. Like everyone just came to hang out and watch Cooper's games. We're really blessed. So thanks family. You guys are the best. We love you. Look what we got. A whole cart full of fried chicken. Have you guys ever had these? Coca, okay. Cocadas. Cocadas, as I say it? Cocadas. Cocadas. I don't know. You guys, we just smell like fried chicken. It's like, it's like paradise. It's like paradise and we're gonna get some ranch right here. I don't know if you guys have this kind of ranch. Where you're from, but this is the best ranch in the world. <laughs> Hidden Valley Ranch. Well, we're gonna check out. I still have my sunglasses on inside. <laughs> it's I don't, cool. I don't yeah. care. Right, can't screw up the store. All right, we're done. Bye. Coop's up at bat. Well, on, no, he's on deck. This is a championship game, so we won our other game. And now we're here. Sometimes we're Why not? Sometimes we're Look, my grandma, my grandpa Joe, my uncle Darwin, my cousin Trent and his son. Oh, my hubby. There's Mandy. Look at this whole crew. Oh, shoot. Let's go, Cooper! Oh! Hey, he's sticking at that. Let's pray he doesn't get hit. All right, let's see you, Coop. Come on, buddy. Good eye. Good eye. Little dirt in that catch. It's okay. Mama. <laughs> it's on the ground, it's like rolling in. Are we golfing or are we playing baseball? <laughs> nice! Go, Cooper, go! Nice! There's my coop. He's getting stressed out, the other team's coming back. <laughs> Look, they're the winners! Prime! Woo -hoo! Look, he's so excited. <laughs> so this is what, three days in this Yeah, but this is what champions look like. Look like. How do you feel? You won? Are you so happy? Yeah, Tell us how you felt when you got Bean right in the oh, back. That hurt. Does but it make I've you kind of mad? Like you just want yeah. to? That's why they charge the mound in the MLB because it just hurts. I don't care if you charge the mound. <laughs> you don't charge the mound. How do you feel? Tell us. It hurt. About your win oh, though. Oh, um, good. Good? We won yeah. this two years in this row. You've never tasted the bitter loss of defeat because we're always champions. <laughs> so it's like this problem. And I wanted to win for my uncle. For your uncle? So here's a really um, sad but cool and unique story. So my grandmother, when she remarried, I never knew my real grandpa. Um, he passed away from a heart attack when I was really, really young. So she remarried a guy named Joe, and he's always been my grandpa. That's who I grew up knowing as grandpa. His grandson is named Justin. This is him on the shirt. Um, and he was actually killed in a car accident after he served a mission and came home and was in college in a, like a weird story. He was on a field trip with the college and there was an accident and they were in an 18 passenger van and it ended up rolling. But he was like the town in Bear River. He was known for 
his baseball abilities, his skills. He was really, really good. And so every year they have this tournament in honor of Justin Huggins. So it's cool that Cooper gets to play in it and, win. and, and just honor Justin. It's cool that I have a little boy that gets to do that. So it was a good weekend. Lots of baseball. Jackson got a farmer tan. Look at that line. <laughs> Damn it, Darwin, you don't show the whole world my farmer tan. Your farmer tan. And we had a lot of family to come now out and support you. Now we're very grateful. Man, now we're three and no. So, anyways, happy weekend. Happy baseball. Woo, woo. See you on Monday. Championships. Monday.